Dear Diary, It has been a long time since last time we talked. And this is because of something called Corona. Well, Corona is a virus that has spread the entire world and has killed over one million of individuals in a very short period of time. That's scary, isn't it? The idea of dying because of respiratory troubles is so terrifying. You know, being unable to breathe and to fill your lungs with air. I have had so many nightmares lately. When I wake up, I appreciate being able to breathe and not being among the 55 millions who tested positive for the fires and who are struggling. Oh, I didn't tell you. I miss my family so much. And especially my mother. It has been months since last time I visited them. Being a med student means I will be visiting hospitals and being in direct contact with patients from different cities. Who knows? I might go back to my hometown and bring back the fires to my family and my friends. This is why I'm using video calls for hours. It's better than losing one of them. when I hear about the people who come from foreign countries to visit their families. How can they do it? Couldn't they wait for some months? How am I feeling these days? Well, I started being obsessed with the idea that everything can be contagious. You know, putting my hand on something and then touching my nose, or my eyes, or my mouth. Wow, this means one act of irresponsibility can lead to dramatic consequences. This is why I started paying attention to the mask and to clean my hands very well. and to use the sanitizer whenever I touch something in a public place. Not only to protect me, but to protect others too. You know what really makes me feel sad? It's the fact that I'm not able to have my friends and my family as I used to. 
And there's something so weird. I don't know if it happens only with me or no. I'll ask my friends about it tomorrow. I started getting a weird feeling when I see two people hugging each other, even in old movies. You know, my heart starts beating so fast and I feel scared. I think it's a psychological fear that developed due to the stress that we have been living in during the previous months. But it's a must. Their health is more precious than anything else in life. Finally, some fresh air. Wow, air is a luxury that we have never felt thankful for. But that's wonderful. The smell of the wet grass. And of the spring breeze that kisses my face. Choosing social distancing became an automatic act. We became enabled to share anything, even air. Excuse me, uh, I've used all of my sanitizer. Could you please lend me some? Sure. Thank you. Here you are. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a nice day. Thank you. But at least we still share one responsibility, which is to save the human race. Because humanity matters, life matters, and health matters. I'm sure one day all of this will end. And I will go back to my friends and my family and I will hug them so tightly for too long. I will sleep peacefully like I used to before without worrying about my loved ones. I will do everything I am sadly deprived of. I will go back to living freely with no restrictions. Humanity will sure win, only when we choose to follow the rules. All we need right now 